Hey, what's up? Uh, this is Armand and DB. Uh, this is a Wednesday before the IFB North Americans. Um, I just arrived to my hotel about 20 minutes ago um, from uh, Arlington, Texas, and uh, took the 30-minute train ride here to the hotel, and I'm here now. Uh, I feel pretty good. Um, I just started my carving up phase today, so I'm at, I carved it pleated for about three to four days, and I'm just uh, adding them back in some white rice with every meal right now. I usually hold water, um, as most people do when they get off the plane. Um, it's about a three and a half hour flight. Uh, the change from now to showtime. Um, just a little fuller because uh, I just started my carving up process and tightening up at the same time. While I'm filling out with carbohydrates, I'm going to be dropping my water and I drop my sodium tomorrow. So um, it's just going to be a completely different package than uh, last time you saw me. And um, I was really happy with this past, um, you know, off season. I stayed pretty lean and uh, I put on some uh, good size and kept my waist exactly the same I'm just making small steps each year to um, eventually you know, earn, earn my pro card. I competed last year 2008 Junior Nationals as a light heavyweight. Um, going into the show I was planning on competing as a heavyweight um, but at the last I, I was ready to go about 208 but I was like um, I knew a couple people in the heavyweight class Michael Libertori which of course won that show and then went on to turn pro um, so I wanted to make it to the light heavy weight class. Uh, that was kind of costly. I burned a little muscle. My legs came in really stringy and so did uh, the rest of my body and I had um, gynomastia and that was a big um, counteraction uh, to my physique and a big distraction and um, they count off a lot for that and um, I got that taken care of and uh, th I worked on all my weak points this past season. I put on about 20 pounds of muscle um, I've uh, been training a lot harder. I've been trying to bring my legs and back up more, which they're slowly coming up. Um, my lines are a lot better this year. I attribute that to um, staying in more, not going out. Um, I don't party or drink or anything like that anyways, but just staying in more, just resting, and get as much rest as possible when I'm not training or eating. Um, I did a lot of traveling this past year. Um, and so pretty much just staying at home, living a, you know, normal life, going to bed early, waking up early, you know, and training hard. Yes, I brought up my legs, brought up my hamstrings, brought up my back. Um, I trained shoulders every other week to kind of bring, you know, they didn't shrink any at all, but just to kind of balance my body out more because I'm kind of figuring out, you know, more how to balance my body out. Whereas before is like, oh, I like to train this, so I'll train this really hard. I don't like to train this. I'll still train it hard, but I won't, you know, so I'm just trying to find a balance between everything and learning um, everything and I'm you know progressing each year and I'm and, you know it's a really exciting and it's a uh, really challenging and you know I like the challenge and I'm looking forward to the show a lot my lines look a lot different this year I think it's a little bit of maturity too because I'm 25 now yet yeah, last year you know I was just kind of starting to mature a little more and then I picked I took about a year off, you know, from competing. I didn't go crazy, get really heavy in the off season or anything. I just stayed, you know, around about 240 or even less than that. But, you know, ate good foods. I did, you know, I had a couple cheat meals a week. Okay, I'm over here with a couple of uh, my food items. I have some some almonds. Like I said, I've been eating a lot of fats on my diet. Um, I have the rice, a lot of rice. Um, I eat with every meal right now. I f already finished my steak meals. Um, I have all my rice cakes, my natural peanut butter, which I usually eat after uh, my last meal before prejudging. I'll have, you know, a rice cake with some peanut butter on it every like 15 to 20 minutes before I get up on the stage. Um, the rest I'm just going to be ordering from the bodybuilding menu at the hotel as Muscle Tech Nutrition takes care of uh, that expenses. Um, and uh, I have some of the nano around here somewhere. I can't find it. Um, I just came in, but I like to take the nano about three times a day. It gives me keeps my body feeling full. And um, I'd like to thank my uh, sponsor, Muscle Tech, for uh, you know taking care of the show for me, bringing me here, and I'm you know looking forward to you know showing off uh, my new physique Friday and Saturday and showing. Uh, the fans and uh, muscle tech what I have to offer and that I'm bettering myself each and every year.